Ah, right, excuse this. This is all a bit hit and miss today. So, welcome back. This is week. I don't know, I missed out that many. I think we did 40 in the other week, but this is probably more like 70. So, this week I have got a diesel eater to fit, solar panel to fit. I've got the seat legs here to get the seat that's just behind you in and get the solar stuff in and that will be the plan for today right guys well part one of this solar panel i didn't really want to show you but i've got it going right bolt <laughs> you got it keep pulling there should be quite a bit spare under there Right, that's at the max of the panel. So what we got is the solar panel. There's a box underneath that, it's better than that. And this is why it's going out up the heating vent and then it's gonna go down into the bus. So that can be thrown off the side. You don't need that. You better throw that. Coincidentally, these from the range, don't buy them, they're shite. Always get a good B and Q one. Oh, right, back down now without breaking my neck. We got this wire through here now. Sure, there should be a bit more than that, but it's still coiled up a bit. No, it's not. So that's the max we got there. So now we need to find a way. I'm possibly just going to bring it out of one of these and trunk down here, down to here, using this wire which is, well, it was attached to the really shit solar panel but the battery's all in charge but to go with the solar panel we do have um, a different controller well I'm hoping I don't get a copyright strike in the gym so this controller can come off the wall mm. The new one's going in the same place. And then we can look at getting that set of seats in there. And then the diesel eater. We don't have any diesel for yet. But we've got big plans for the diesel eater. Well, I say big plans. We've got plans on where stuff's going. It's whether we can get stuff to where we want it. It's going to be a different story. I think I'd better put the screwdriver in. At least these are the same size. Now I know this is supposedly quite a good charger or solar management system, but we've got a 24 volt to 230 so we need to be able to charge two batteries now this will do 24 volt but through one set of wires so we're going to go with the other one which is also a name brand which is better than in whatever they could get off Xinjiang market this time and the airport use them so they can't be that bad but then again that is too big now put so this one isn't fancy, it doesn't have a screen. do not tell you half of the information the other one did. Hang in the But we can easily put another voltage indicator on it, that's not a problem. In fact we've got one down the front of the bus. But it's been outside so I don't know whether it'll work, but we can always give it a go. Oh, this is going to be under our table because there are our table marks there so I've got to measure that up yet and all so fun. right so that's that one in Hi guys. so welcome to my standard sticker channel we'll start Today with I'm going to make a sandwich let's paint and color them together because you're, you're nearly there so it's close enough 
So the solar panel we got off um, Facebook of all places for I think it was 50 quid for the panel and the panel and the um, charger. The guy wanted Y and Z. Now I know my ABC. Sing with me. I think these cutters could do with a bit of a um, 2D party. I'm super glad that's what I don't want. The people that make these have not come into the 21st century yet where everyone uses flip sets. Now these are from the range as well, so I expect them to break. Mm -hmm. So, we'll keep the colours, because the other panel does actually have colours coming off the panel. I don't know what voltage it's producing at the moment, but we can assess that in a moment. So, blue to blue, brown to brown. Yeah, the chances are this is going to have to come out slightly again to like put like chunking in. If you want it to look neat, we don't want a wire running down the wall. But we could have quite a few wires because when we rethought it through, we're going to have chargers on this side as well. So we're going to need to run wires up and through the roof. Just we'll see how many preservationists we can annoy by making it non-standard. No doubt there'll be a few. But then no doubt you'll come right on my bus and you'll use my bloody chargers. You'll slag them off and then I bet you'll use them. I need a smaller screwdriver now. Let me put the screwdriver back. Make a note of it. Put it back. You finished? Finished? Yeah, I do have the foreman with me. Who, as usual, always believes she's in charge. Let's have a look what we're producing. More than 20 volts. Twenty point seven volts. And bear in mind that little shit thing that's outside the window could barely do twelve on a this day. It was struggling to do ten before when we took it out. Um, this is an upgrade. So back down here now. I need to wire this up positive. Back to flathead. Do that. I think they've already been undone. But positive. There. Negative in there. Now the other thing is we don't know if this charger works. But it's come out of the guy that we bought it of has just put a new system in his van. Um, so that's why this was now. This battery needs moving. That's about the right amount of wire on that. This battery needs moving. So we will move it. But just for a moment we will see if we can get some charge going to it. Uh, that's negative. Mm. Then before we wire it all in, we can see you know it does work. Or no, it doesn't. So it should go to red. Is it is nearly empty. We have lights.
We have a red flashing light, whatever that means. But it's not picked up the, the sun unless that LED does not work. Let's see what voltage it's putting out to the battery. It should only be 12, well, 14 volts. 10. Now that could be that the battery is so flat it doesn't want to play ball games. Um, but we don't know. But it's in, it seems to be working. Just to check we've got voltage on the terminal. Ah, you see we don't have voltage on them terminals, that's why it's not predicting the sun is there. So why is that? We've got... Have they just not made a good connection? And I had this with that one. It won't make a good connection. Just because of the type of wire it is. And it's household three quarters. Which one of these is not quite touching. Well, hey! We're on. So, what voltage is it put in here? 13 volts. So, at that, hopefully, that will change into uh, yellow. And with that, because it does two batteries, you could stick that big bastard on it and hopefully it might recover that but that is like flat as flat so, right, well that's that done Trump it <laughs> No? I think the Chinese haven't quite translated this properly it apparently is a portable hair air heater well, it is portable. If you've got the vehicle to portable it in. You can now find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Patreon, Twitter, and Instagram. As said, Mang Bosses. Find us at mangbosses.com. Mang Bosses. We're sorting scrap. <laughs> <laughs>